Okay then, um, it's Graham Davis and Naomi. Um, uh, the Mini 7 race is just about to start. I'm just heading over to the pit lane, which we'll see the lads starting. A uh, few people in the way here. Big Welsh boys. Spencer wants to on park position. Can't see where the lights are. Just falling up on the grid. Right, Lots you. of the flickers going around. It's first on the grid. Spencer, second Tom Sarnes, and third Max, fourth Joe Thompson. The lights on. Yes, yeah, the lights on. Right, just a live video. Yeah. Let me just go over to the other side. We have to go backwards and forwards for this. Yep. Now we'll start taking up our positions on the other side. Grab a little bit as we come here. I right, get the focus coming down from when they come down off the hang straight. I can't remember the names of the calls. Can you remember the names? No. <laughs> I'll drive it. I can't say I do. Right, that looks like Spencer and the leaders are going down the hangar straight. Tom second, Andrew Devine third. So Joe Thompson third. And Spencer out the lead, Max third. Oops, Tom Sanderson went wide, was it? Yeah, Spencer well away here. Uh, second place, Max. Third, Tom, Joe Thompson. Oh, well held. Oh, that was that like Leon actually. Sorry, Leon Whiteman it was. Leon. Leon had a big moment to grab. Lots of luck up there. And uh, one or two oh together, God. isn't he? Uh, Duncan Emmett and uh, Andy Dickinson. Duncan's going a bit sideways. Something happening down a bit lane straight. Okay, that'll be yellow flag, possibly a safety car or a straight tow. We'll have to wait to find out. Thank you, good going again. Oh, sorry. Hello, Nancy. Um, you appear to be one of our top fans. And hello to Mark as well. I think Mark, you're watching the Migley race earlier on, which was won by Aaron Smith. Uh, Mini 7 Championship could be decided if Max gets in the top three today. Um, Spencer wants to the other person who could win the championship, but he'd have to have two wins at the weekend and Max would have to finish outside the top four. And we've got a little tractor van coming up, double wave yellows. So hopefully people move back from the car. Uh, Spencer's one lead, the front two are just away. Uh, Dan Bud in third place. Uh, fourth Joe Thompson, fifth Leon, sixth Tom Sanderson, Don Berger, Nick Ryden Fowler, Julian Proctor, Ross Wilson, and down to the Cooper, Hi Jonathan and hi Alessandro. Very Italian sounding name, Alessandro. Sounds like someone's lost the exhaust actually there. <laughs> Don't know whether you could pick up the noise, but either Andrew Cavini or um, Dan could have lost their exhaust pipe. Right, so that's still Spencer leading from Max. Third is. Oh, can't tell us third. I think Joe Thompson's fourth. Looks like a red oh, roof. Got good eyes. <laughs> you do the commentary. Try and do the commentary at the same time, yes. 
Um, keep it cool, keep it cool. That's why I'm actually the every time I watch the So we've still got uh, Spencer leading. So Max just had to sit there technically to win the championship. Dan Bud, Dan Bud's third. Fifth, Paul Thompson. Conbergen, Ron Fowler to the end. Ross Bilston, Gareth Hunt. Ron Thorburn. Leon Oliver Whiteman round the back with Stephen Colbrand, my fellow commentator for the first race. And we've still got uh, these rest classes coming in. I think it's Duncan who's actually lost the exhaust. Duncan's the one who had to come together with uh, Andrew. Right, coming down is that Max gone into lead past Spencer. Spencer got a slight problem, like he wasn't handling quite so well. Uh, Nick Croydon there is leading the S class at the moment. This guy is Scott Kendall. Oh, he's in a blue car, so for an orange car. Um, as soon as I'll be able to find The back group coming through here. Andrew Devaney. I've got him in an orange car. Last time I out raced myself, he was in an orange car. Um, but I believe he's in a blue car now. So next time I'll have a look out for him and try and follow him round. Assuming you're related in some way to uh, Scott, Millie. Okay, do I reckon it's Dutch or German? Max has just got a huge lead just come out. Joe Thompson's come into second. And Spencer has dropped. He's got a punch on his front right hand tyre. Spencer's got a punch on his front right hand tyre. Which way it's out. No, that wasn't. Um, yeah. uh, that's. Scott there. Is it? Is it coming up? This come down here, Nick, has in the pits. Okay, that's Nick Boyd and Fowler out of the S-Class race. So leave Scott Kendall leading. Tie wife then. Okay then, Millie, um, it looks like uh, Scott has actually just gone to lead. Nick Boyd and Fowler's um, just pulled off. Nick's had quite a few failures this year in the car, even though it's sort of an S-Class is supposed to be more reliable. Now we get a little bit of the boring bit when they're um, all spread out and there's a bit of a gap between the cars coming round. Um, uh, Max uh, just keeps it on the track. First place, Joe's in second place. Joe won the novice title last year. I taught him everything he knows. Um, Pepper pig coloured pink car of um, Dan Bud's third, then two black cars. Is that Spencer still going? Arlen, I couldn't have changed the tyre that quickly. Um, Scott Kendall up ahead there, 94 was back to the side of it. 55 barriers, 13, 0, 
0.9776.38 cars on the way through. Um, those of you who want to see timing online, you have to go to uh, TSL Timing, which there will be live commentary as well, and you get all the positions coming through. That's Duncan with the noisiest car out there at the moment. Double yellow flag there, so something's happened behind me. Don't know what it is, but now we just spotted over here. There's a double yellow flag being waved, which means there's an instant round the next corner. Uh, more double yellow flags. Joe's just got into the lead. Uh, so we've got a little bit of power down the back corner. Going to watch the double yellow flags. Max can still just sit there and win the championship. Don Berghoff and stands in the gravel. <laughs> I'm trying to look out for Jack Shearing. I'm going to look out for Jack Shearing where he is, because he's the one in the Novice Championship with Stephen Colbrand. Car, Jack. <laughs> right, looks like a challenge for the lead, I think. Max has just gone past Joe into the corner. Yeah, Max is now ahead of Joe. Ah, uh, here we go. Yellow flag, so don't try overtaking at all. As Kieran McDonald has made very good progress up through the field. Colbrand's ahead of him, which I think gives him a good chance in the Novice Championship. Right, so this is Dan Budd has now gone through into the lead. Max has dropped down to third. Dan Budd though overcooked it into the uh, corner. Which gives Joe Thompson back into the lead. Dan got his first win in the sevens at uh, Actually, Spencer's still going. I'm not sure what the problem was when I got down. Andrew Devon, he had a lonely race on his own here. All the flags come in. Here we have Duncan coming along. We can hear him from a long <laughs> way off. <laughs> that is the whole of the exhaust that's missing. Leader's coming down and 
There's Max back in the lead from Joe. This is certainly swapping around. It's a case of waiting till the last lap to make your move. It's a little bit like Fraxton, don't necessarily want to be leaving the start of the last lap. Now, Kieran's driven a very good well, race from the back of the race through to, to fifth place or sixth place. And there's Scott Kendall going through. First the S class, just getting up alongside Gareth. Ross Bilson. Lee Roberts. And again, we've got the seven to go through. Not quite as exciting as sevens, but... Uh, Still close to the new seven races. Sorry, it's the Miglias. <laughs> you hear Duncan and Ryan? They've uh, pulled away a little bit from Tom. Ah, oh. well, uh, I'm damn bad. Caught the back of Tom Sanderson. Coming back just behind them. And then we've got a good race here between so Gareth Hunt and number seven and Scott Kendall leading the S class. Going to hit Naomi's little phone and hope she hasn't got anything <laughs> too embarrassing on the front of it. Still loading, I think. So. Oh. Is that a red flag? It's been a red flag come out. Um, three and a half minutes. Yeah. So three and a half minutes there left. It's still run down. Well, that will give Max the championship. But where it goes back to the last lap, who was um, actually uh, leading on that lap. No, it's Duncan. No, no. Okay. Can't see the reason for the red flag, but it'd be nice to go down and see Max when he comes in. We head downstairs. Naomi, who's our race day coordinator, is with me, so she's going to go and find out. <laughs> What's actually happened? Yeah. Going down the stairs here. Yeah. It's not best to look at the camera and go down the stairs. Back just to the uh, semi area or the uh, post race semi area. And I've got out what has happened. Yes, okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
That looks like Max there. Can't just squeeze through. Max! Max! Hey, live on Facebook. Look, you're sweating away. Oh, so let me uh, let me try and get it so we can actually do it. Did you actually end up first in the race? Yeah. Or not? So you went back it on, one lap. I think I won it on count lap, yeah. Yes? And you got a commentator here, Alistair. Yeah. It's crazy. Get your hands off it. Come try and look cool at the time then, Max. Uh, especially if we won the championship. <laughs> Oh, well done. That's unbelievable. Yeah, no, it's a good race for us, yes. Yeah. It depends on the going back on the lap, it is. So it's either going to be um, um, Dan Bud or. What the other Joe! Well done. I can't have Jake right hands onto it. Let's let him hear his bits onto it. <laughs> Oh, good result. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, led a couple of times. Kieran and Leon. Oh, nice to have you. Never mind then. Well, Kieran. No good. I got punted off on the first corner. Bye. Me Roberts for the gravel. I don't think he meant it. Spencer. It's a bit annoying. Spencer. Okay then, Kieran. What's it like coming from the back of the pack? I'm just from the back of the pack. I come from the back of the pack then. Yeah, can see, see the front pack in front? Yes. Just, just hitting a brick wall, couldn't quite, uh, couldn't quite yeah. catch them out there. Edging closer, but yeah. So what were the ropes down the back straight like? Yeah. Oh, you can't be telling. Who <laughs> <laughs> was screaming? It was making a little noise. Did you get the valve bounce yet? Yeah, I heard a little noise. Yes? Okay, then, and you eased off, didn't you, to save the engine? I did ease off. Yes, that's right, especially if the car's being sold. Exactly. So Kieran's car's up for sale at the moment. Contact Kieran through the Mini 7 Club or on his Facebook page. Um, he's got Miglia as well at the moment, that is um, Mini 7's up for sale. It came from last on the grid to six, I think it was in the end, fifth or six in the end. Then. Well done, Kim. Okay, then. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Unreal. Um, let me try and find Stephen. <laughs> or we could have an interview with Sam. Uh, <laughs> no? <laughs> I know, I know, that's right, yes. You went in his wife red, last time, were you? Yeah, you went in the girlfriend. The girlfriend. No. So, no? Okay, no, which one you selling? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I swear to you now, I'm like, I'm like that. Can we just go oh, for a little wander around so we'll see? You managed to keep going though, Spence. Good effort that was. Unlucky with that. Uh, Spence had a flat tyre, front flat tyre on there, but he managed to keep going for the rest of the race. <laughs> now it's wandered around, I'll stink around the other side, and see if I'll find a couple of other drivers, whether I can get through here or not, or whether I'll get myself in trouble, it's another matter. Got Marshall having a coffee here, doing a very good job. Just doing the live feed to our Facebook page. And got around, well, it's Stephen Colburn's car here, and uh, Guy Dryden, uh, sorry, don't know his first name, Duncan's car with complete missing exhaust on there. Let's just wander through and see whether I get myself in trouble or not from this. Through the garage, Just one road to the other side. Looks like cars are all being weighed. Uh, Tom Sons' car, the first one coming through. Kelvin Edgar's coming through. And uh, we'll just see who there is in the uh, paddock. Hi, Jonathan, good to see you. One of the top fans on the Mini 7 Club. It's always good to get Stephen, because Stephen loves having a little chat into a microphone. Um, let me wander over, I can't see him at all. Um, let's see Ross. Let's see Gareth. Let's see Lee Roberts. Uh, and Davini went up early on there. Uh, let's hit Stephen Colbrand, that's the one to see. Steve! 
believe a my fellow commentator. Okay then, do you have to stand back a bit? Because I've got a little bit closer. I have. That's it. Let me. Oh, that's a bit better. You can come closer to me now. That's about there. That's about there. It is then. So, what was the race like, Stephen? Yeah, I won. You won yeah. in the um, novice championship. You mean, or the S class? I won the race. You won the whole race. You did. Yeah, yeah. First over the line. You were then. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, sort of it is. <laughs> but this guy like Max was a little it's bit like further in front when of you. The track day the other day. I was like, I won. <laughs> no, it's, it's Stephen's really, having uh, it's really good illusions of grandeur, or whatever the word is. Yeah, that. yeah, no, it was good. It was um, being in an S class. You've got much taller gear, and coming back down the back straight, you just basically drive around everyone. Um, it's good. What revs are you getting to down the back straight with uh, it? Seven, one. Seven, one. That's quite a lot for an S class, so then, probably, isn't it? Yeah, I, I hit seven and a half once, and yes. thought, yes. Uh -oh. So yeah, the engine held together, so it's still sort of oh, yeah, quite a lot of the mixing there. Okay then. So it's the yes, best yes. You can get. See where Joe came? Joe came second, I think it was in the end. Bit of confusion, says so count back on the lap. Yeah, um, he was really leading. Um, oh, did they count back a lap? Yeah, they count back a lap on the red flag. Oh, did, that's a shame. did you see the reason for the red flag at all? Or? Yeah, it was, um, it was Darren Eaton and. One of the uh, other cars. S class. Blue S class. Blue S class? Yeah. Scott Kendall? No. No. Jamie Bull. Jamie Bull. Jamie, sorry, Jamie, Don't you're watching this back. Yeah, um, <laughs> they just came onto the hangar straight and just drove into each other, so I just kind of. Okay, that's so just in place, it wasn't that bit there. Calm down a bit. Now we've got Liam, who's a little bit calmed Steve down here. Is he there? The other part of the. Um, Hi, everyone. Racing is bittersweet, isn't it? <laughs> it can be. You've been shouting. Yeah, just a bit. Swearing. Uh, right. Swearing at himself for getting it wrong. And then, um, yeah, a little mishap. Someone went up the arse of me. Into the side. It looked like he had damage on the side of his car, though. Yeah, I don't know what happened. But, yes. Um, all I know is I was at the back of the grid 30th. Yes. I had to come through and pick some so people off. Yes. I was, uh, yes. Following Ollie down the back straight, but I wasn't racing with Ollie, so I just kind of uh, hung, no. hung back and uh, right. coming along with you. And uh, but, um, I think I did a decent lap time. So I later on, I should. So it'll be good then for the second yeah, race then. Yeah, that's yeah, right. Let's have it. Okay, like we've just got Jonathan Colts and he can't live stream onto the TV. He just gets a strip across him. Sorry, Jonathan. Buy I don't want to do that. <laughs> you probably yeah. need a new telly. Graham, yeah, our black yeah, and white yeah, ones on there. Graham, Tech get, support get with Graham. The, uh, yes. Hi, everyone. Since uh, Graham's been on the gimbal, it's not It's the same, a bit different then. Okay, then the car's all going through and we're going to finish the live feed now. We'll be around for the Miglia feed later, the Miglia race later. Cheers, Graham. Cheers.